Oh, aren't you looking? Oh, my Just got a flower. <laughs> one for mom and one for dad because dad cries if he doesn't get a flower. <laughs> we are in Quetzal, uh, a winery in our regional in Teju. And we came to check the art museum that we have here. Lucas to an art center, so we wanted to see how things went, if he would at least like it, and how he would react to, uh, to things like paintings, which is passively uh, to look at something. And he surprised me in the beginning, but yeah, after him, half an hour or so, he becomes a bit restless, and yeah, it's about his limit, it's a half an hour of art. <laughs> At least that's what we found, because now he's just running around. One thing, I really love the modern design, interior design, and this was my favorite spot. This looks like a radish. It's peppers, green peppers. This is coentros in Portuguese. I think it's coriander in English. Hey! Psst. Uncontrollable. We came to investigate some ruins that we saw from the winery. Up the hill seems to be a church. We are gonna see what's there. Let's say it's a boat that we're on. Just like in the old times, exploring the abandoned sites when when I was a teenager, that was one of my passions and where, where I lived, there were a lot of abandoned places and together with friends we would enter. Of course it was dangerous, but yeah, this, we need to see what's, what's there, right? Look at it! I take a plinth! Wow! I totally didn't expect this. It still has paintings inside. Oh. Let's see. Let's
This was a perfect ending for our morning. Uh, it was quite surprising. We just saw it from from the winery and decided to come here. And you really do feel like you're discovering something that no one else knows and only you because you saw it from down. Also, Lucas doesn't stand um, modern art apparently. He can take it for half an hour. But his favorite thing is uh, running about in the nature. So it was really good for him too. Oh